Do you want to sit down? I can hear you fine. You talk to me normally, remember? Right. Right. Sorry. It's okay. It happens a lot. So you, you wanted to tell me something? Your mother said you have a child who can't hear. There was an accident not too long ago. We're pretty new at this. It's okay, but being deaf isn't what you think it is. Did, did my mother tell you how I feel? No. Well, then how do you know what I'm thinking is wrong? Because you wouldn't look so sad if you understood. So I don't get it, huh? Do you think you can explain cochlear implants to me? All I know is that I don't feel different. And they don't stop you from doing anything. I pretty much do what everyone else does. I go to school, I hang out with my friends, I play sports, mostly soccer. Yeah, what position do you play? Goalie. It's the hardest job of all. It's my thing. My mom worries about me sometimes a lot. Mm. <laughs> well, you know, that's, that's what us moms do. It's kind of our thing. Well, she doesn't need to. I do well in school. I'm the president of my class. Which, like you said, helps with the girls, right? <laughs> Sweet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jason, we got to get going if you want to make the movie, OK? Coming, Mom. Good luck with your son. When he's older, if he ever wants to kick a bar around or anything, we know who to call. Ian told me he's gonna move the barbecue. Better eat up. You're still thinking about Jason, aren't you? It's not that I don't think he's great. He is. He's he's incredible. But he's not Spike. When I look at Jason, I see him for who he is, not who he used to be. I, mean, I don't even know if there was a before. But with Spike. You know how he was when he could hear. Well, we all know that, but. But when I look at Spike, I see the baby that he used to be. Happy and healthy and on the verge of saying his first word. When I look at him now, I'll never be, be able to, to look at him the same. I'll, I'll always think it, it shouldn't have been this way. And I'll always think about the pain that Greenlee caused him. Spike's not broken. But he's not whole. Thank you, Kyle. Yeah, you bet. Do you remember when you told me that you didn't know who you were until Spike was born? He's the one that taught you how to love. Mm -hmm. Well, he taught me a couple of things, too. Spike did? Yeah, he did. Well, you both did. Package deal. And I loved that kid before he was born because he was part of you. Yeah. Um, he taught me how to be a father. I think I could do that after Eve. Spike's pretty incredible, isn't he? Yeah, he is, and he always will be. Spike, Spike, it's not gonna change. I know. But the way people react to him and talk to him will. When you saw Jason today, did you see someone different? Did he? No, no, I mean, I... I had no idea that he was deaf until my mother mentioned it on the show. Right, you just saw a kid. I like to kick the ball around like girls, probably in that order. Just a happy little boy. We can give that to Spike. It wasn't supposed to be like this. I mean, I know I keep saying it, but it wasn't. Everything you want for Spike, everything. You can have, you can have that right now. If we do this, if, if we give Spike these implants, it'll be like, like it's over. It's just the beginning. No, I mean, if we accept that Spike is deaf, we'll be saying that what Greenlee did doesn't matter. 
What if we go through with this? What if we get Spike the implants? And, and Greenlee thinks that everything's okay. That, that what she did to Spike doesn't matter. Scoot. We need to take Greenlee out of this equation. It's about Spike. Not you, me, Annie, Ryan, and definitely not Greenlee. It's about Spike. And how we can make his life better. Okay? I think I am done talking about all this. I think the only thing that matters is that Spike and Ian are healthy and safe. Fair enough. Yeah. Let's go. Okay, there is a... Uh, there's one thing I have to do first. Just a second. Joe. Oh, Kendra, Joe. how are Hi. you? Hi. I'm good and good. How are you? Good. How are the boys? Good. Uh, I'm going to see Ian first thing tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. And Spike, um, if, if you don't mind taking the time, I would like for you to tell me a little bit about getting cochlear implants for him.